the Soweto Comedy Festival. Yes, it yeah. used to be held in Soweto this time around at the Lyric Theatre and in our studio to talk about it. Skalk Poseidon, how are you? Hello, how are you? Good, good. good. Well, I mean, I don't know why I'm saying that. I've been here for... I know, you saw me the whole morning. Yeah. You even gave me a kiss on my cheek. Wow! Uh, Very few people get to do that, by the way, Skalky. <laughs> you've, you've reached new grounds now. Soweto International Comedy Festival. Did it first begin in Soweto, now this time around it's at the Lyric Theatre. Tell me yeah. quickly. I think I think it started in um, Soweto and it's just like grown and grown mm. every year and it's like evolved a, a beyond the place they usually had it because more people want to come. So now it's at the Lyric Theatre and it's the yeah it's the as you can see it's the international comedy festival. Mm. Great international acts. Um, Courtney G is from the USA. He's part of the Deaf Comedy Jam. Oh, um, wow. Which is like a big thing in the USA. Then Brian Higgins from the UK. I've seen him before. Yeah, he's, I've seen he's him. He's cool. Uh, Joseph Apia from Uganda. Carl Joshua and Kube from Zimbabwe. And then the local guys are Dave Levinson, um, personally one of my favorite South African comedians. Mm -hmm. Kereboni Mulua Hutsi, who's performed, I think, for like three presidents wow. of South Africa. If that means anything to you. Um, <laughs> Jay Boogie, who uh, recently did his... He, he's like a big favorite in Soweto, if any Soweto people are watching right now. He did his one-man show recently at the Soweto Theatre, which okay. sold out. So yeah, it's tonight, it's at 8 p.m. and uh, tickets range from 150 to 200. Um, yeah, Is it tomorrow it. night as well? Yeah, tonight okay. and tomorrow, and tomorrow night. night. Yeah. It, it's Brilliant. interesting. You know what's exciting? <clears throat> I mean, Skalk Poseidon is here, even though he's not on the lineup, supporting the whole comedy group and representing Cape Town basically in the lineup. And, and so are the internationals. I mean, people come and they get together. It, it seems like there's a whole brotherhood, sisterhood uh, amongst comedians supporting. Yeah, it's, like, it's always fun to meet uh, international comedians, mm. especially because, like, yeah, like you say, there's they're just like a, a natural camaraderie. Mm. Even though you, you just just meet each other and we go and we'll show each other around. The, these are the comedy clubs in Cape Town, and then yeah. you know that when you go to the UK, when you do whatever, like I can send a message to Brian Higgins yeah. and say, could you hook me up with a few gigs or okay. these are the dates I'm there or whatever. Quickly, what are you planning for 2014? You've got the play right now. What else um, is coming up in your list? Just just general general stand-up gigs. Yeah. Um, I'm doing the Cape Town Funny Festival, which is from the 26th of May till the 22nd of June at the Baxter Theatre. Okay, okay, cool. And then um, I'm in a show with three good comedian friends of mine, Oliver Booth, uh, Bradford Keane and... Uh, Glenn Beedham and Pam. It's called Four Young Whites. <laughs> um, yeah. And we, we do shows all over Cape Town. Our next one is on the 6th of April at the Assembly, which is a, a club there in town in Harrington Street. Yeah. Okay, well, we yeah. wish you only the best. Thanks so much for Thanks. bringing Soweto Thanks News. And me. yeah, you're so talented. Skulk was said in our Feel Good Breakfast Show studio. And you heard it's Soweto International Comedy Festival happening tonight and tomorrow night at the Lyric Theatre. Stay tuned to your Feel Good Breakfast Show.